who are looking at the sergeant control panel. In the middle we have the power on button. We need this on for the 12 volt system to start working. Going to the left we have the water pump on and off. Next one along we have the tank heaters. If you're out in winter you have water on board. Make sure your tank heaters are turned on. And when the temperature drops down to plus five degrees, the tank heaters will then turn on as long as it is lit up. And that will raise the temperature of the water by two degrees. They'll then go back to a sleep mode. As long as that is still illuminated, it will come on and off as it needs to, to stop you freezing your tanks. To turn them off again, you just turn it off. Going this way, we have our gauges. So leisure battery, vehicle battery, fresh water, wastewater. We know this is the fresh water because it has a hole at the top of the tank and this is the wastewater because it has a hole at the bottom of the tank. The leisure battery one is indicated by the caravan style symbol and the vehicle battery is indicated by a cab. If it is green it is good on the batteries, if it's yellow it is charging and if it's down to just the red, it's dead. Your water will go up the gauge for the fresh water and up the gauge for the waste water. When it gets down to the red, that is your water running out and it will bleep at you. On your waste water, it goes up the gauge and when it gets to the top, it will bleep at you until your waste water is full and that will need emptying. This one is your lights on and lights off and this one is your awning light and that indicates above the door on the picture to indicate the awning light is on awning light is off this one here indicates that you are plugged into the mains you haven't tripped the electric at the minute it is charging the leisure battery it will charge the weakest battery first have a vehicle or leisure it will then swap over and charge your battery on its own if you want to override the system, we just touch in the middle of the vehicle battery one. It is now charging the vehicle battery. It's indicating amber that it is charging. When it's fully charged, it'll go to green. If that battery is running down, it'll go to red. To go back to leisure battery, we just touch on here. And that go across the leisure battery and it indicates that the leisure battery is fully charged. The battery that you're selecting is the one that you're using. If you're not plugged into the mains, make sure you are not on vehicle battery, otherwise you become a caravan if that battery runs down. If you're not plugged into the mains, make sure you are on leisure battery. That is the battery you are using, as well as charging. Draining your wastewater and fresh water, that is done through the panels here. You'll need the control panel turned on. If it indicates red, on here that means that the valves are open and that is in the drain process to close the drains we go to the green on the waste green on the fresh and that has closed the valves once you've closed them you can then put them into the off position and that will open them and that will drain your fresh water and wastewater. Always advise you drain down when not using it and always drain down in winter due to frost damage.